thought I'd give you a little bit of an overview today. The rail, uh, rail trail is right beside me here and behind me is Woods Lake and also in the distance is Kalamalka Lake. So today's ride we're going to do the Woods Lake Loop which is partial rail trail and then they've got a beautiful loop on the older highway section that goes all the way around Woods Lake into Lake Country and reconnects with the rail trail and then we'll be coming out of here. Later we're going to have a nice barbecue uh, at this beautiful park down here and uh, gosh I should know the name of it. It starts with a K-A-L. Um, I'll get you the name in a second here. I feel like an idiot not knowing the name. Anyway, there are beautiful washroom facilities behind me. Suzanne is doing a pit stop, so that was something that's new as well. Right where I was standing was an actual older building change house for Woods Lake Beach behind me here. So um, that's nice to see that the community has uh, really upped the game here to help us, uh, like, and you, if you ever come here and experience the Okanagan Rail Trail. Nice facilities. So on this section there is one railway trestle and a gorgeous ride around the Woods Lake section. So pretty cool. Zero. Here we are. making the bend around Woods Lake to the south. We're heading to the east and then we're going to go on to the Okanagan Rail Trail. This is really a nice loop. A little bit of traffic but we we persevered and uh, timed the light okay. One of our favorite restaurants coming up here, the Greek House. If you're ever in Lake Country and you're really hungry, you get lots of portions on your plate and they have great Greek food here.
Yeah, there's the rail trail behind us. at the end of the loop where the rail trail meets Oyama and then uh, we're we'll be heading to the park after that so this is the uh, main parking area in for the uh, Oyama boat launch parking this is actually a really good place to park and ride the Okanagan rail trail it's very quiet here uh, for the times we've been here anyway. We finished the loop. We did the loop. Now we did the whole loop. Okay, so how long did that take? Um, about 45 minutes. Yeah, that was fast. Yeah. That's pretty good. So we started here at the brand new washroom facility. And there's Woods Lake. So we went all the way around this lake. And in front of us here is the Okanagan Rail Trail. Keola Regional Park. Do you want I to go? I think the one that was by the parking lot is oh. less windy. Okay. The ones by the lake, I went over there and they're kind of windy. Yeah, all right. We've never been to Kaola Park. And it's a pretty nice place to uh, walk around, even bike around in our e bikes. Don't want to go too fast. A nice little cold. Yeah. Okay. And then, like, we can just park our bikes here. Yeah, I'll go in. Grab the truck. Good idea. It's nice and sheltered too. Well, there's sun here if you wanna. We didn't bring chairs, did we? Yep. Oh. I like to give these like three minutes to side and then sear them. I overfill that anyway. So just what we need.
sure smells good. So we checked it and it's like 135. So Look at that steak. Nice. Well, did you have fun today? Yeah, well, we had a little bit of a mishap with my bike. Yeah. Um, we started out our bike ride and something didn't feel right with my gears and I looked down and there's a mound of fishing line tangled up in my gears and I don't know how it got there. I must have, it must have been flying across the trail and I just drove into it, but it, it kind of put a damper on our bike ride today, well, but. There was a lot of fishing line that we had to um, pull out of the back rear cassette of the e-bikes and we well, ended up with a big mound like yeah, this. So <laughs> luckily it's, it happened just after we left the parking lot so we weren't too far away from the truck so I could ride my bike back to the parking lot and then we just spent about 45 minutes pulling all this fishing line out of the gears of my bike and we got most of it out. I can still see a tiny little bit but anyhow after we did that then we went back and did our bike ride and we were able to do the whole Woods Lake Loop today. So it actually turned out to be not bad after all. Although we didn't get as much filming in as we wanted to because of that. Cause... Well, what we'll do is we'll give you a, uh, a, better, in, a better video on Woods Lake Loop because we've spotted out some areas that we want to launch the drone mm -hmm. and whatnot. So it's in today's video is just going to be a quick sort of drive through but one thing that we did experience was this beautiful park that we're in mm -hmm. um, never knew it existed before and uh, the name Suzanne is Keola Regional Park Keola Regional mm -hmm. Park so if you haven't um, ever explored it if you're in Lake Country highly recommend if you just want to get away from the uh, hustle and bustle of people mm -hmm. um, it can be busy here it was busy today of course it's a long weekend here in mm -hmm. Canada um, that being said, we're here now five o'clock enjoying our barbecue supper and it is getting to be deserted. There are people well, leaving. Yeah, there's a few people that have left. Um, but the way this park is situated, it's, it's really nice because you got lake on either side. There's lake behind us and over in front of us. So this park sticks out on like a little point and there's um, a playground, picnic tables, um, nice grassy areas and there's lots of um, beach space so I noticed a lot of people bringing their paddle boards here because the lake is very calm and you don't have a lot of boaters here so it's a great place for paddle boarding or kayaking. There's two beach accesses mm -hmm. you know, to the front of us and behind us over here. It looks like we're in front of some woods well there's a lake and a beach right behind the spot here. It's just gorgeous. Well, that about wraps up this video today. Uh, thanks for coming along with us again. And uh, yeah, and don't forget to hit the subscribe button too. We appreciate that. Mm -hmm. Thanks for following us. And uh, we'll catch you on the next one. Mm -hmm. Bye, friends. Bye. <laughs>